I believe we just keep going this way. We're following old Bear Paw. Ah yes, there's the helpful, hopeful sign of the confidence place. Strange forest expression. I'll add it to my collection of weird things humans do in the woods. Folk art. Here's our confidence place, and we're heading this way, continuing on old bear paw through a pine forest. Sassafras Grove. Actually, this is something else. Alders. a glimpse of civilization, if you want to call it that. I'll have a turn coming up before long. Okay, so we just did a turn there, and now the way I indicated is this. We're in the august town of Marlboro. I wonder if it's named after John Churchill. <laughs> Probably. 
you gotta figure Churchill's stunning victory in the Seven Years' War at Blenheim would have been the early 1700s. And this town probably dates back to that. And back then, the word probably traversed the Atlantic of John Churchill's great victory. And so, Marlborough. And this is another fairly easy turn. It's uh, that way goes up to the north and ultimately Newburyport after Sudbury. And now we just pretty much follow this right of way for a while. And before long we'll be coming to a failed track development that has now reverted back to woods. Yet another ghost venture. Chippers is bombed. And here's another old chestnut shrub remnant. Must have been a whole stand of them along here. round of you figured it out. Still on the old bear paw. Slightly. We leave the bear paw, and that also takes it to Broadmeadow Road. And we're closing in. Oh, yeah, we're right at the boundary of the Sudbury Reservoir property and all the dire. Stern <laughs> rules they have about don't mess with the water. Cool. Yeah, we're in the home stretch. 